Good evening, everyone, and welcome. This is Melissa with the Stock Swish Show, and I'm here to review Twitter. Uh, Twitter is gapping up tonight on earnings. However, this isn't perfect. Let's just take a look at it. I looked at this chart today when I was looking in the room, and forgive me, my voice, I, I have some kind of a cold here, but uh, so my voice is a little hoarse. But I did look at this this morning because I knew the earnings were out tonight. And I know it's something that has to do to be perfect. And this really isn't perfect. Could this work as a long tomorrow? Yes. Do I have a hundred percent conviction it does? The answer is no. At fifty, Twitter is an immediate buy. But it's not capping up to fifty. Now it is at forty five, forty fifty six, and tomorrow morning is a long way away. If Twitter opens tomorrow morning at fifty dollars, you can buy it. So or beyond. But at this point here, the problem is that this stock is not in an uptrend and you would be buying something in a downtrend. So this really isn't good enough and actually may go red on the day. All right. And that's just the story here. I haven't looked at this chart for a while, but when I looked at this morning, I thought, boy, this thing is having some issues here. Uh, let's just look at it. Rallied. This is when I first came out, rallied, made a new high here. Nice rally all the way up here, almost to 75. Gap down, gap down, gap down, fell. Broke. Okay. Twitter was in a downtrend in here. Didn't last. Started to be neutral. And Twitter actually is neutral. And I would actually call this neutral slash bearish. So this activity in Twitter is neutral slash bearish, even with the gap. So that's the story. Okay, and I really am not crazy about buying Twitter until it does what I call fixes itself. And that's here. <clears throat> it's $50. So if Twitter opens tomorrow at $50 or above, you can buy it with 100% conviction as a long. Otherwise, this may not play out right today, uh, tomorrow morning when it trades in any direction. Could it hold? Yes. To have 100% conviction, it will? No. It may even be a short. This isn't doing anything of significance. It's what I would call a nothing gap. Like, don't do anything with this tomorrow. Don't buy it and don't short it. It's like a waste of time here, basically. So that's the story on Twitter. Very interesting chart. Haven't looked at this for a long time. And there's just been nothing to do on it. But this will be a great long once it gets to $50. It's better if it happens in the gap rather than trades up there, though. I'll tell you that right now. So we'll see what it does. This is Melissa with the StockSwish.com. If you're interested in the Golden Gap class, it's this weekend, February 7th and 8th. Email me at Melissa at the StockSwish.com to sign up. Have a great day, everyone. Don't do anything on Twitter tomorrow. There's no play here. I'm just doing the video because I know a lot of people like it. And there is a small possibility it could get up to $50 tomorrow before they open, before 9.30. But I think it would be doing it tonight, actually, if it was going to, and it's not. So there you have it. <laughs> good luck, everyone, and have a good day tomorrow.